Men, have you reached a decision? Yes, sir. Did you work as a team? Yes, sir. Thank God for that. Zach, who is the blue team's first nominee and why? We had nominated Jeremy because we saw something that wasn't going right with one of the dishes that he was doing. And he refused to take the criticism, telling us to get off his station, and he got it. The mistake of the, of the cooking is one thing, but then the arrogance to not want it to be corrected is something totally different. We can't have that kind of attitude in our kitchen going on. I'm not asking you to kiss each other's ass, but when you walk into that blue kitchen, you work as a team. Jeremy. Were you arrogant? Is that right? No, it wasn't that I was arrogant, Chef. I was frustrated at the situation, Chef, and I lashed out. Frustrated and you lashed out. And whilst your frustration's building, you're lashing out and the customers aren't getting fed. Zach, second nominee and why? Our second nominee is... Sebastian. Why? Sebastian is a good guy, but it's a time and a place to play. Zacky, wacky, in the middle of serve. Like, you, you know, we're trying to execute dishes. We can't have that going on. If you're not serious now, I don't got you getting serious at all. Jeremy, Sebastian, step forward. Let's go. Sebastian. Seriously, you want to fuck around in the middle of service? Why did you come in here? I love cooking. This is something I love to do, and I've been, I've been putting my time. Today, I know I dropped the ball. It's just sometimes my personality comes out in the kitchen. Before I came here, I knew one of my biggest problems, one of my biggest challenges is my attitude, and uh, it's something I have to correct. Jeremy, you're one of the youngest in this competition. I thought you were in way over your head. Why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen? Chef, I fought for everything in my life. I've strived to do better. I've always done better, Chef. I've succeeded at almost everything I've tried. Today, I failed. I don't plan on failing ever again, Chef. I let my team down, and I never do that. Not only did you let your team down, you then gave them shit. You got yourself in the weeds. You started giving shit to the team. That was one comment, Chef. One comment. One comment. Tough call. The person leaving Hell's Kitchen. Sebastian, give me a jacket. Get to what I said, okay? Damn it. It's a kitchen, not a place for comedians. Good night. Right now, I'm disappointed with myself. I came here thinking that the challenge was going to be to beat the other chefs and win Hell's Kitchen. And I found a way to defeat myself. Hell's Kitchen, man. It's no joke.